Hello everyone, this is Seppi. In this video, I'm going to show you how to paint trees in sunset. This video is part 2 of Trees in Sunset. Let's get started. Um, after drawing uh, the subjects with um, 2H pencil on the cold press watercolor paper, and the brand that I'm using is Arches, I will start uh, wetting the whole paper using spray bottle and one inch flat brush. Since this is part two of uh, the other painting, I put the other painting right beside this one to figure out where the horizon line is uh, when I'm drawing. Then I will lay the same colors for the sky down onto the paper, the same as the first painting. Colors that I use for the sky from top to bottom is French ultramarine blue, permanent rose, cadmium yellow and then I also use uh, the same colors almost but with more purple and ultramarine blue for the snow. To make the far seen trees I will wet the paper uh, from the horizon line to the top I create a wet um, ribbon and then I will start putting my colors down and let them bleed into the wet area using brush number two. Colors that I'm using for the far seen trees are purple, permanent rose, and a little bit of burnt umber or raw umber. When I'm painting the far seen trees, I paint in between the trunks um, and I try not to go over them. The next step is to make almost the same color that I uh, made for the other tree trunks in the other painting. Since these two paintings are two parts of one picture, uh, I want them to be related and the colors to be consistent. But before uh, putting the colors down for the branches and trunks, I make a dark blue color uh, for the snow and I lay it down onto the branches and now as you can see I am putting dark brown color for the trunk which is a combination of raw umber, uh, French ultramarine and purple. You can use Windsor Violet for your purple or mix your own purple using permanent rose and ultramarine blue. I'm using brush uh, number six to paint the branches and I use the same colors to go over all the trunks. On the base of the trunks to help the uh, viewer to feel the sense of weight of the trunk and sense of the trunk to be implanted inside the ground, I darken the bottom of the trunks, the roots. Uh, right beside the snow using more blue and purple. I'm using purple and blue um, and going over some of these like darker areas and shadows on the snow. Now for the blue I also consider cerulean blue and mix it with ultramarine blue and also purple but more cerulean. There are some trees in the far scene that we can see them in details and I'm also going to exaggerate some of the branches uh, in the far scene using my uh, brush number two. Adding some dark accents on the snow and then what I'm doing right now is drawing uh, more twigs and branches with my brush number two using almost the same colors that dark brown which could be raw umber and blue and purple I keep adding more twigs and branches to my trees and for this I have to be patient you can practice drawing your branches with paint and brush on a piece of paper before you move on to your final paper now I'm adding some bushes in 
different parts of the painting and my work is done. Thank you for watching.